YouTube fam, what is good, you guys? Julian Cakes here, and um, yeah, like I said, um, Julian Cakes is my new name. Uh, I made a decision to make it. Like you guys, some of you guys already knew my my first in the first video that I in my comeback video, you guys could call it. Um, yeah, like I said, everything's gonna be new in this channel. And if you guys are wondering why I'm talking like this, is because something real bad happened to, happened to me, and I just want to get, I just want to forget about that. And something it was something real bad that happened to me. And guys, kind of, you guys see me a little like traumatized or shivering. It's just something happened. You guys want to know the story? Just comment down below. Like, subscribe, give me a thumbs up. And yeah, let's get started. Positive energy, like always. So yeah, you guys, like I said, um. Well, I was supposed to, I don't even know what I was saying. I don't even got some energy right now to even upload this, but I'll upload this for you guys because I want you guys to have some content on this channel at least so I can begin uploading more videos now and make the promise that I made that I'll upload now. So, yeah. But like I said, you guys, um, I will be doing a video and just to start off this channel, uh, good. I just want to make a, a collection. You guys already know that I made two collection videos past few videos that I made were two collections and then one was like for 2018 and this one is practically for 2019 and I'll uplo uploading in 2020 because I didn't upload for shit in 2020 but right, you guys so this is practically the, the 2020 collection and let's get started in three two one all right you guys so secret number one I'll just start running because I don't feel like it. just feel like like doing stuff right now but yeah I got the like, easy box you feel me um you guys already know the Yeezy box, and we got the the Yeezy butters. Um, I, I like I, I like them. I'm, I'm sorry, guys. My 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 energy's not good right now. I'll try, but yeah, you guys. Um, I I wear these a lot. You know what I'm saying? That's why they beat the fuck out of. Look at that boost is really beat up. And the the just in general, they're dirty. Just cause I, I wear my capes. I I wear my capes. You feel me? I don't keep no shoe dead stock in this. In my collection that I have, it's nothing dead stock. My one well, might be dead stock, but that's because I, I clean and stuff. But yeah, this shoe is really like not beat up, but it is worn a lot. As you guys see that that reflected three straps. I love about Yeezys. But yeah, you guys, Yeezys are just comfortable in general. And yeah, um, secret number one, got the Yeezys. Let me do secret number two. All right, you guys, for secret number three, um, here we got um. The stereotypicals, the the robbery phases. I'm just kidding. Oh, these are my my all black forces. He has a practically stereotypical because a lot of people think that some people think that they don't they don't trust nobody or they just don't but when nobody they have these type of sneakers. But I don't give a fuck with that. What people say about this, I love black forces because literally it's a really durable ass shoe. Like look at this. Um, it was really snowy today in, in Denver, Colorado. As you guys know, some of y'all live in Denver, Colorado. You know how snowy it was today and shit. And yesterday also, I wore these to school. And look at that. Like, I wore, I wore them in the snow and everything. Saw it and look at that. They're just wet, I guess. And a couple of dirty and stains and all that. But, I mean, you guys know that this shoe is really cleanable. I love black horses. Because it's also matchable with any outfit. Like, yeah, and I love black horses and... Oh yeah, for there's also some secret heads I just do not like about this. It's the freaking star, the fading stars right here. You guys can see there's no stars here. It means that he just, he just don't like them. But some secret heads do not like that. Some say that's some thing, but I don't really give a fuck. Like I just like I said, I wear my shoes. And yeah, nothing just but um, yeah, black forces. Well, sneaker number three. All right, you guys, for sneaker number three, we got also some simple ass shoes, some some phases also. But you guys. I mean, I don't know why I say phases, but I mean, they're also forces, but yeah, no much. But yeah, these are uh, my, uh, my freaking, what are they called? The, the mid tops, yeah. So I really like these because it's like an all white shoe. You just can't go wrong with these type of shoes, you feel me? Like, um, can't go wrong with this shoe. Like, it could, could match with also outfits, also. Like, not a lot of questions or anything, but it could match with this hoodie that I'm wearing. And yeah, you guys, I do wear the fuck out of these. Like, look at this. Really beat up. Like, there's even a hole in the freaking um air units right here and stars are really faded like really really faded faded and i wear the hell out of this shoe a lot and you 
yeah, I just really like this because, I mean, where could you go wrong with these type of shoes? You feel me? So, moving to sneaker number four. All right, you guys, for sneaker number four, we are moving with um, these ones right here. And these are also beaters, but these are my daily. So I wear these almost every day. I got the uh, the low top forces, the white, the all white ones, but I did add a little touch to them. As you guys see, these are a custom I did. Um, these I, I added a bandana over these. No, I'm not a game banger or anything. This just just gonna I'm not a game banger. I just really like how they look like with bandana and all that, especially with the black one. That's why I added a black bandana. And uh, these are really beat up. Like, look at this. I wear these almost every day. No stars on these ones, neither. And obviously, there's now holes on. There's actually a hole right here. And there's a hole also in, in this one. So, as you guys know, I do wear a lot of my shoes. All of my shoes are just wore, let's just say. And yeah, um, these are really beat up. Like, like you guys don't even know how, how much I wear these almost every day, daily to school. And secret number four, I think. Hold on. Uh, I think it's a secret. I don't even know. I don't, like I said, I don't have no much energy, but yeah. Secret number four, I think. Yeah, four. Yeah. All right, you guys, for secret number five. Um, so I got I got a track now. It's fine. So as you guys see, we got the um, just a simple, comfortable Uggs. You feel me? Really comfortable. You feel me? Like um, just can't really mess with these because these are a winter shoe, and I really like them. And, um, yeah, these are really comfortable, by the way. Like, I'm, I'm not going to even cap. Like, I put these almost also every day, every, especially also in the house sometimes and everything. This shoe is really comfortable, especially the inside. Most comfortable thing you could ever have. Um, and, yeah, I, I really like these Uggs. Also, these are kind of beat up also. Like, look at that big-ass crease right there in, in the Uggs. But that don't give, but that don't really disturb because I don't give a fuck because, you know, like, I wear these also a lot. And especially for the winter, I'm gonna beat these up. I'm gonna beat these up till winter ends. In fact, because I'll probably buy another another pair in the next one, the next fall winter. So yeah, sneaker number five, move to sneaker number six. All right, so for sneaker number six is the Grails. In my opinion, it's the Grails, the everything most expensive shoe in my collection. But yeah, you guys, um, you see the bread eleven. You feel me? This is the most expensive shoe in my collection. Yeah, it's the easiest, but. These are more newer, you feel me? And this was my last pickup of the of 2020, the Yeezy. What am I, what am I saying? What am I saying? Yeezy. Uh, but yeah, these, these are, this was my last pickup of 2020, the Jordan 11s. I really love this shoe. Like, y'all don't even understand that. I really, I don't even, you guys don't even know how much I love this shoe a lot. And this is really, 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 I really love this shoe, you feel me? And as you guys know, Jordan 11, patent leather, right here, that classic patent leather, that Jumpman 23 right there. And yeah, we got all these good details on the shoe. But what I really like about it, it also is that this shoe is really, this 11, this specific 11 is really durable. And I mean really durable. It's like, um, it's like if I were to call it um, a cheaper, I mean, no, a more expensive or exclusive pair of like Air Force type thing because uh, these ones also do not um, get dirty on, unless you really worry about the wipe. I don't give a fuck about that. But yeah, you guys, um, uh, these are really comfortable. These are really comfortable also, um, considering that it's a basketball shoe basically. And um, I really like these also because um, because they're just they just they're matchable with any outfit. In in fact, these are matchable with any outfit. Um. Yeah, and oh, I was saying, yeah, they're really durable also because, um, what's called so this bottom right here specifically, nothing will happen to it. Like, that's where it goes. You guys know that there's for some seekers, I know some 11s, a lot of 11s, majority of all 11s have them, um, clear soul, icy soles, and all that. And they tend to yellow over over the years and and a lot of wear. So, that's what's ass about the really ask about about those 11s i don't know like um when they're beat up so i love this 11 for that reason because this shoe right here this red is like i mean during the past i mean if i wear this a lot the the only thing that will happen to the red is literally probably get a little more darker but it really don't, don't disturb me i don't give a, like i said 
It really don't serve don't serve me, but yeah, um it's a durable ass shoe. Oh by the way. You gotta have the carbon fiber right there. What I love about that shoe, because this shit never scratches off. Never scratches or anything. So always stay fresh like that. And also what I really love this shoe about and it's gotta be that Nike Air. And yes, I'll have the Nike Air stick for the rest of my life. I don't give a fuck about 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 the about all this about all these type of shoes that have that the um the freaking you guys know that that, that sticker thing that having the insole. Uh, I'll let it fade, but this one I will not let fade away. That's why I taped up that hoe up instantly as I got it from release. Nike Air will not ever fade away from my life unless something tragic happens. But yeah, you guys, um, yeah, you guys like these are the Bread 11s. Also forgot mentioning the box, that fresh ass box I got. Nothing too special, really. It's just a cardboard classic box. What I really, really, really like about the shoe. That they came with this box because this this was actually one of the first boxes that Jordan started releasing with this. And there's just really nothing. There's actually nothing Jordan related just for the the tag. But, but yeah, nothing Jordan related. And what I look about is that it came with uh, this card Jordan 11 right there. I won't read it though. And um, it came with this. What I really like about 11s in general is that they come with this shoe uh, tree type of thing. In fact, I have another pair right here. Right here, also, yeah, you guys. So, this was sneaker number uh, six, I think, five. I don't know, I forgot. It's six, yeah. So, we're moving on to sneaker number seven. All right, you guys, for sneaker number seven, we got um, some right here. Got these fucking beat up shits. The the work phasos, you feel me? Uh, these are actually my work shoes, these are the high top phasos I bought like I was in eighth grade. and I really like the shoe when it was brand new and dead stock. Now it's not like with this crappy ass shoe. Really creased. No stars at all. Like scratches and everything. You can see scuffed in the shoe. This shoe really, I really ran a lot of miles in it. Not ran specifically, but I put a lot of miles in the shoe. Like you guys can see um, how beat up the shoe is. I bought this uh, well over two years ago. I think I was in eighth, I was in eighth grade two years ago. So yeah. I really wear these a lot also around the house when I do something um, with with work or something. Yeah, these are my work shoes also, so yeah. Moving on to sneaker number eight. All right, so I guess for sneaker number eight, we got the NMD, uh, Adidas NMD. These don't have a because I'm cleaning them, but I really like this shoe because this is really comfortable in general. To be honest, this shoe is really comfortable. It's as it's comfortable as uh, a Yeezy. Also, but this is way more comfortable because this shoe is literally full of boost on the bottom. And I, that's what I love about the shoe because this shoe is really comfortable, especially the, it feels like a sock. In also, I look really good sock in this shoe. And I really like about, about these type of shoes that are really comfortable. And you could probably get them cheaper now because I remember when NMDs were really, really hyped. This was, this was basically, if you had these, you had basically had brills and stuff like that. So, uh, sneaker number eight, I'll probably have a sneaker number nine. All right, you guys, so here we got sneaker number nine. These are my also beaters, you feel me? I wear every shoe here is worn, so I'll call them my beaters. But, yeah, these are my Vans classics, you feel me? Uh, just a, a simple classic van. Black and white, what could I say about this shoe? Really much with some outfits also. I really love this shoe because um, I just wear these to school a lot, like, you can see how I wore the hell out of the, the fuck out of this shoe. Like, look at that. I wore the fuck out of that. Like, you guys can see how I wore this shoe a lot. And I even worn to, like, when it was, like, snowing and everything. Like, yesterday it was snowing. I didn't know that it was going to snow. And I wore it. And I was wearing these. And I really got my feet soaking wet because this shoe straight up, it will not have nothing warm to do with the shoe. Like, straight up, you can wear this in the cold. It'll, Damn right, this shoe's gonna get your feet cold. So yeah, that was um, all of my sneakers. So thank you guys for watching. Um, sorry that I wasn't really having a really positive energy. I had something not trustworthy, but something bad happened to me. If you guys want to know the story, just comment down below. If you guys, if you guys don't want to know it, then yeah, just just say. I don't want to hear the story, but yeah. Um, yeah, you guys. So that that was like I said, new name and everything will change. And our and I'll upload next week. So yeah, see you guys later and peace out, y'all.